Hi, I'm Noelle Randall, real estate millionaire, entrepreneur, mentor, speaker, author, mama five, and so much more. In this highly anticipated episode, I am going to show you Noelle's Golf Resort Luxury Mansion. Yes, I am going to show you this eight bedroom, eight bathroom, fully furnished home. This is an amazing project that I am so excited to share with you. It has taken nearly a year to put this whole property together and nearly months to put this video together just to show you. Wow, I'm about to show you my office. This is where I literally work and I'm gonna show you how we transform this bedroom into my office. Let's see it all. Let's go. So excited to be in this room. This room we took, it was a bedroom and we converted it to an office. Yes. And so one of the first things that you helped me do was get this customized sign from Fast Signs. Mm -hmm. I had this big grand idea, remember that I wanted this big sign and then we ended up having to change it up and do like this lacquer plastic yes. thing. And then what they did was they put my logo on the side of it so that we could remove this if we wanted to. to. It's not really difficult, but it is custom made. And I really feel like it does a lot for the room. This is yes. literally where Your I work, space. I'm able to film. And I think this is a great thing. Cause like I yes. am an entrepreneur, I am a real estate professional, but at the same time we do YouTube, you know, we exactly. have a podcast, we have books, we have things with media. So to have a space where you can work, you know, obviously my executive producer chair, I'm getting into making videos and movies. <laughs> I got a record label, like things are really crazy. Yes. So you know, I redid the light. Yes. Do you remember this light was get, in the wrong get, place? This yes. is beautiful. I love it. Classic. I love it. It just reminds me like of a diamond ring. Bling bling. Yes, I love bling. <laughs> these two, at one point we had these over there. Remember, because like I'm a tourist, everybody knows that. So I love bull, the but bull. I really love that bull because of investing. People don't know the bull in investing represents an up the market. Up market. An up market. So you've heard of bull market, bear, bear. market. Bull market is an up market. A bear market is a down market because bears kind of walk with their heads down and bulls walk with their heads up. So I just love ah, what the bull represents for investing okay. wise, not just the tourist thing. And then you got all that money kind of, it's just like a subliminal. And don't forget the color. It, right. It's and it has the, the pinks splasher. and the blues. So you did, yeah. I did, we did really good with that. Let's talk about the, the bookshelves because we had these bookshelves at one Next point. We're to trying to like figure out how to do this office. And at one point we had these two bookshelves, this one, and this one kind of like side by side, like right here. Mm -hmm. And it just didn't fit. I really feel like this just looks so much better. This whole like look. It sense of sense of calm. And like you said, you got to be in a space that you love. Yes. So now is this a space and you I love? love the, I do love this space. I love okay. that you helped me with it. I love it. Like you said, you want to work in a space that also brings some sense of peace, brings some sense of calm. So it was just cleared it out and made it neatly and then use what's functional. Yeah. These drawers. Yes. So. That's where your stuff is. That That's what's is. functional and everything right. now. Right, a real shredder because I really shred <laughs> yes. dots, a real printer and copier. We, we have switch. a lot of meetings here. Yes. We use this TV what would you for want a me to lot of stuff. Yeah. You would usually have your laptop. Like if people saw I, us in real life, sit there. I would be on the floor. She'd something. be sitting on the floor with her laptop. <laughs> We'd have an HDMI cord from her laptop Yep. to that TV, because yep. that's how you got to do it. I yes. have this new function, I'm fancy, where I can push a button and whatever's on my screen will go on that TV. On the television. It's crazy, I love and it. And we can look at and it and we can get work it. done. Even with the couch, remember? The pillows it came with. Yes, oh, right. so this is a funny thing. These were the pillows. <laughs> that it came with. And then we switched like this, like it came with this pillow. Yes. Which I just thought was super weird. And then these were like all matchy matchy. <laughs> And I was just like, why is this? This is not really that great of a look. But then when we took this pillow that came with and moved it to this blue, it was like, wow, this is really pulling out the blue. And I was just like, this is a really good look. And then this tempers all of it together with these more solid. And I just felt like this was just such a good look. We always have love a candle it. lit. You know I love my Chanel. And not because I love Chanel, like the products. You know why I really love it and why I fell in love with Chanel was why? the brand. Okay. The brand. Do you know Chanel never goes on sale? Did you know that? I did not. There are no sales. You're not, oh, they're having a 20% off sale. Never. No, never. No sales. I think it about does it. Not I've never go seen on that. Sale. Not a one sale. Never. Even Gucci sometimes will have some things and things like Chanel. And you never. can only get Chanel at the Chanel store. There is no it's Chanel exclusive. outlet. There is no Chanel outlet. Do you like the exclusive? I do. I love the you exclusive like the and I love like the, the, the value of her things go up because she only makes a certain amount. 
And then, so it's like, say for example, I buy some Chanel earrings. She's only gonna make a certain number. And so I have those and so I can sell them and they'll go up in value. Everybody. So I just that. love Coco Chanel as a brand. Everybody knows that. You see, I have the Chanel sign over right here. There. So there's just a splash of Chanel throughout. And again, it's more uh, iconic about the brand. You know, I'm not like just saying like, oh, Chanel's a great thing. I just really, as an entrepreneur, I am impressed and inspired ah, by Coco Chanel. Love it. I really love am. It. I am so inspired. And that's why I said this room speaks Noel. It does. Because it's a splash of the things that you like, yeah. the things that you admire. Yeah. And you may always make me feel so good too. You put my books up here so I can be like, oh, look at Noel has books. And you then my Amazon bestsellers. Actually, all three of my books. Yes. Just like, ah. So that, that is this room here. I love it. Did you love everything about that space? I love my office. I love working in there. And now it's time for me to show you my next favorite space in this house, the bar area. So this is our custom bar. This is one of the fun things that I did with this property. This property had just like the most boring bar area, but it was absolutely beautiful with this wonderful quartz, like yes. grant crowner top. It yes. has these amazing gray cabinets, a stainless steel refrigerator, but there were no shelves. There were no places to put wine glasses. It didn't really seem like a separate space. You know what I mean? If you guys can see from the befores, it just was this blank space. And so now I was like, let's really define it as a bar. And one of the first things I did before I bought anything before the shelves, any of that came in, I saw this light fixture. <laughs> and I was like, this light fixture just screams bar. bar area. It, I like the colors. I wanted those old timey I mean, Edison bulbs. Uh, I just the whole thing. Yes. Just the yes. whole thing. And that was actually the only thing that I think I bought and did in here. And the rest is like all you. <laughs> and But the thing is, you have that one focal piece that ties it all together. Yes. Because that really is that piece that made everything easier to match it. Right. And bring it in. Right. So, so let's yeah. talk about these floating shelves in this custom bar. Because this was custom made. I literally did not have a carpenter that could do this. I literally went to an app like Thumbtack. I think it was Thumbtack. Yes. Um, yes. And again, no affiliate, anything like that. It's really just an app where you can find contractors and things like that. Yes. And we found this amazing, I found this amazing carpenter who said he would custom build this. Yes. But before I could custom build these floating shelves in this whole wine area, we wanted to have some definition with these walls, walls. and really like define out the this coloring. space. Yes. So your team did this. this yes. So you talk about so that because I wasn't even involved. Same with <laughs> the painting. You know, we were thinking, are we going to go darker because we do have the darker cabinets? Yeah. Playing with that idea. And then as we really start picking out colors, we found that this was the perfect fit. Um, and then we, were, we knew we were going to match this with the chairs yeah, and just the, the accents and all that. So that's what we did. We just match the color, mix it, put it on the wall. Yeah, because these were white, you yes, know, so see the transition. First it was, at the way this started, of course, it, it was, was just wall. Yes. And then we added these slats and they were white, completely white. Yes. And this is actually a light gray paint. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if people are able to pick up on that, but it's a light gray paint pulling in some of those grays and then we stained this the yes. same color as the bar yeah. stools. Got it. And then he custom built these wine glasses you know, this wine glass holder. And I was just like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. You know, just cheers. And as a fun fact, I got this as a gift oh. before, right before we moved in here. One of my friends, um, a great entrepreneur, sent me a bottle of Dom Perignon. I have never, ever drank Dom, Dom Perignon, Perignon, ever. And I still have it. <laughs> Because as it's you will notice, a special it occasion. came like this. Yeah, we're going to toast to this today. This is a special occasion. We, Everybody has been asking and begging for Noelle to show this property, show what I've done. Yes. And so we are going to pop this open today. And I'm going to drink some Dom Perignon from 2010. It's vintage. It was a gift. Cheers to my friend, my <laughs> entrepreneur friend who bought me like $500 champagne. <laughs> but this is amazing. Okay. I cannot wait. I can't either. Cheers. The texture, that is really what was important. Yeah. Just to kind of give this a flow into the space, but also give it a separate look in its own space. Right. These slacks. Really, just to find the space, you know what I mean? It really separated that upstairs living room from this being the yeah. bar area. This seems like an area that you would come to. It obviously has, you know, no carpeting or anything like that. We have some amazing, you know, I'm not a big drinker in our family. We try to be in the fitness a little bit. Yes. But some days we have a day and we need some whiskey. Yes. So somebody bought me this awesome 
some whiskey nice decanter. I, just gifts. Yes. Like amazing gifts. Obviously, we got some more expensive wine. We also got some cheap wine because this is probably more so what we drink. Um, okay. I do come over here in the morning and we have a Keurig and coffee. make the coffee before yes. I go into my office. Um, this is a great space to work in. All right, so let's just check out the front so we can get the whole look of yes. this and even some of the yes. fun things that we did to really define this area as a bar. So this is all you, first of all. <laughs> I that love whole that. thing, this whole just decor of you this um, is all you. Simple. This smells delicious, you guys do not know, but this is obviously plugged in and this is wax candles. Yes. It smells great, it looks great, it has this old timey feel to it. I just thought that was amazing. I think it's from Walmart, nothing too expensive. Same type or of life. Kohl's. Yeah, same type of light, same type of texture. You found this piece and just kind of put it here with this tray and then this flower. I just thought absolutely amazing. I love it. Of course, these chairs and these stools are from my favorite um, furniture company, Bayer's. And we'll talk about that. Bears. Most of the furniture in here are either from Bayer's Furniture or from Haveries. It's a few things in here from City Furniture and things like that. And we'll talk about where mm -hmm. things are from and how much things cost. But these are very yes. expensive chairs. These are Tommy Bahama Chairs. Chairs. Yes. And I just thought Tom I had never bought anything Tommy Bahama. Most of it was too beachy. Yeah. You know, it's like a really beach beachy. theme if yes. people don't know, but um, it just went so well with and the like quality. this color. You know, even though the floors are grayish and we went with a lot of grays Gray. downstairs, I felt like we could easily bring some browns and start pulling out the browns yes. with this. And, and I just feel like just it just flows this, so well. Kept with this beautiful. Yeah, I just thought that was so. <laughs> kept with the texture. Yes, yes. We brought a little fun in the bar. Yeah, so of course this is a bar. What bar would be complete without darts? Just okay, so you be. found this amazing, expensive dartboard <laughs> that I was like, ooh, fancy. Very nice. Um, weird story, I actually play darts. So I was like, <laughs> It has to come, it does. but it just fits in. It just ties in very lovely. I, I love it. Um, everything about this area. This is one of my favorite spaces. Me too. It Me really too. Is. And it's so funny because we literally, I have sat here, laptop here. You see, we added yes. this fixture so we have more plugs and chargers <laughs> so that I could charge my phone and my computer. And I have literally been here just working and kind of sometimes just looking to the right out there and just seeing see that beautiful view. view. Yes. It's just amazing. I love it. Wow, that was such an amazing space. Thank you so much to Mimi Welch for helping me put that space together. Also, a special shout out and thanks to Bears Furniture. I absolutely love those bar stools and thanks to Kohl's and so many other furniture places where we got those little knickknacks. This was an amazing space. Thank you so much. Now, let's go to our next space. <laughs>